Hello everyone. Welcome to a sold Saturday. And yes, I know this is being posted on a Sunday. That is because I had to rush home to help my mom get ready for my brother's graduation from high school party. Um, I wasn't planning on coming home, but she said she needed help and there wasn't many other people that could help her, so I thought I would. So yeah, I don't I didn't have time on Saturday to edit in all the pictures of the things I sold over here and so yeah, this is going up on Sunday. Please forgive me. I promise that soon my videos are kind of going to go back to a normal schedule and they're going to be better quality. Yes, I know that it looks weird that I'm like making it so that you can't see my face really, but that's because the sun's over there. And so that gives me better lighting, but also gets in my eyes, and so I'm blocking my eyes. Whatever. Sorry, you might have to deal with this for one video, <laughs> but I promise it'll go back to normal soon. You came here for what's sold anyways, and that'll be here, so just watch that. So first, I sold this Anthropology Angel of the North button sweater. Um, this I had forever. I was about to kind of give it to a consignment store or something, so I accepted an offer of 15 which I've never done on an anthropology piece, but that gave me $12 profit, so whatever. Take it from me. I also sold this Adidas Originals Hawaii pattern tank top. Um, I had it listed for, I think, like 36 or 32 and it accepted an offer of 27 so that gave me 21.60, and that was from the bins. Um, I sold these Lucky Brand Watermelon Shorts, which you probably saw in a haul recently. And those hold for full price for $36, which gave me $28.80. I sold these Steve Madden Glite Black Suede Boots. They're like ankle boots. Um, this style of boots sell really good if you have these like suede little ankle boots, especially if it's a decent brand. So those sold for $32, which gave me $25.60. I think I had them listed for like $46, but I need to make up for the lost sales from that vacation to Minnesota that you guys know I just went on because I had to put my store into vacation mode. So yeah, I need to make up for lost sales. Shockingly, I also sold this um, brand that I'm not going to destroy, so I'm going to put the name down here. Um, it's a like convertible like backpack shoulder bag thing. That's not all they make. They make just like normal purses, I'm pretty sure, too. It's like an Italian brand, and it's leather. And that sold for 100 which gave me $73.51, which is surprising because I honestly didn't picture ever selling that. Let's see, I also sold this Coach Ivory Colored, like, it has like a metal plate on the front, kind of wallet. Um, that sold for 21 which gave me 15.30. Again, I've had it forever, took a low offer, just get it out. I sold this Madewell set list pullover top and rugby stripe for 22 which gave me 17.60. Another low offer I took to make up for sales. I sold this Victoria's Secret striped bikini top for 25 which gave me 20 This I'm so happy I sold. It is a coach white shoulder bag. Um, it is leather and it has three compartments and it sold for 55 which gave me 44 This I've had for a long time and it had a pretty big pen mark on the front and so I was about to just give it to like a consignment shop or something. But yeah, then someone bought it for 55 this past weekend, and so I took that in a heartbeat. Yeah, so that's awesome. <laughs> I already sold these Free People Black Dahlia Gladiator sandals. Um, those cost me a dollar at that Annex store, and I sold them for 45 giving me $36. Um, I had them listed for 55 I believe, but again, need to make up for lost sales. And 45 is still pretty good on those, so... I also sold these Free People Gray Cargo Long Shorts um, for 20 which gave me 16 This was a much older Free People piece, so 20 is pretty good on that. Um, I sold this J. Crew Wool Silk Panel Floral Sweater for full price, I think, at 36 which gave me $27.30. 
I also sold this Got Inked Cushion Eyeliner by, I think, Scylla, it's called, like S-I-L-L-A, unless it's Scylla, I'm not sure. A hot second ago, I thought I would try clearance makeup from TJ Maxx and see how that goes, since makeup can be expensive. Didn't work too hot. Bought maybe like four or five things. I've sold two, and it's been a long time that I've had them. Never going to do that again. This sold for 14 gave me 11 5 I also sold this Lululemon Sequence Tank in pink and black. Sold that for 25 which gave me 20 This is an older piece from Lululemon, so 25 is not that bad on that. I also sold this Athleta Red Stripe Tank Top. Was about to give that to a consignment store. Sold it for 12 Got me 9 5 I already sold these Sam Edelman Silver Patty Heels for 25 which gave me 20 and those cost a dollar at the annex so that gave me 24 or no that gave me 19 profit so this free people oversized black lace tunic for 25 also gave me 20 I sold this prana orange and purple tank top for 22 which was what I had it listed at and that gave me 1760 I sold these Rebecca Minkoff Sandy Strappy Sandals, kind of a tongue twister. Um, those were also from the Annex Opitz store. Those I paid 10 for, and they sold for 65, which gave me 52. I had them priced at 100 because these are expensive sandals. Rebecca Minkoff is expensive. Um, but the person offered me 45, and I countered with like 80, I think. And then we just kind of had like a price duel back and forth, and we ended at this. I'll take it. I need to make up for sales again. I also sold this ASOS maternity green rose dress for 30 I had it listed at 40 because it was new with tag. Um, but I took the offer of 30 because I'm not sure how maternity is going to work for me. When I bought this, I didn't know it was maternity. So just thought 30 is probably pretty good. But I didn't want to risk it. So I sold this Bailey. 44 twist front blue top that sold for full price for 38 Bailey 44 is a pretty expensive brand um, and that gave me 30 40 in profit I also sold this hobo international black nylon fanny pack which was just in I think like my last haul or the one before for 30 which gave me 24 I had that listed for 40 because fanny packs are very in and hobo international can sell pretty high but when I saw an offer popped up, I was like, okay, well, if it's 30 or over, I'm just going to take it. And it was 30, so I took it. And last but not least, I sold this Coach Sea Dream Pink Purple Wristlet. And that sold for 23 and that gave me 1840 Again, lower than I probably would have wanted, but I need to make up for lost sales. So I hope you guys like this video. I know it's probably terrible, but at least I gave... I gave you my sold Saturday, unlike last week. Um, please stick around and subscribe because I promise they will go back to being kind of better videos soon. And also go check out my other videos that aren't absolute garbage like this one. <laughs> um, thank you for watching. Goodbye.